Hello beauties and welcome to my channel. So in today's video I'll be showing you my recent Amazon purchases as well as my drugstore haul and my recent Sephora haul. And I'll also be showing you a little sneak peek of my makeup artist kit that I just started to collect. So if you want to see all of this, just keep on watching. And when I was filming this video, I also included my PR haul, but there were so many packages and this video was so long that I decided to divide it into two parts. So today I will be showing you my purchases and in the next video I will be showing you my recent PR haul. So stay tuned for that. So first of all, let's start with my recent Amazon purchases. And I got myself a couple of products for my makeup kit. So over here you can see that I have a pack of 250 disposable lip gloss applicators, so I really like the pink color over here. So this will be perfect to apply lip gloss or lipstick to myself or my clients. And I also got another set for my makeup kit, so this one is makeup mixing plate. So I really like how over here I can mix some cream products and in these areas I will be able to mix some liquids. And it also came with this spatula. Here is my makeup kit case and my husband got it for me as a present for last year, New Year's Eve. So there is a section with a pocket over here. So over on this side you can put mirror and some brushes. And on another side you can see that you can put just on top of your suitcase. And this is how it looks inside. You can see that we have pockets over here. You can put some brushes, lip liners. I put eyebrow pencils from Stila over here. There is another pocket inside. And this is how it looks inside. You can see there are a lot of sections and this is actually very easy to remove and you can put them in different areas depending what kind of space you need. So you can see I already started building my makeup kit. Most products that I have over here, actually almost all products that I have over here are from Stila. I have concealers, I have liquid eyeshadows, I have some lip glosses, more lip glosses from Stila over here. I also have highlighter and bronzer sticks, Stila double deep eyeshadows with shimmers and also matte eyeshadows on another side. And I also have a bunch of Stila concealers. And I'll try to find all of these products online and put links in my description down below. So if you're interested in anything that I'm showing today, just check out my description box. I will probably put a link down there. So now let's move to my drugstore purchases and first of all let's start with this nail set. So I got myself a couple of nails. So this one is from Kiss. So it has 30 nails with 12 accent nails. And by the way this is what I'm using on my nails today. So you can see up close some of the nails are matte, some of them are glossy and some of them have beautiful decor. So I really like them. It also the longest nails I ever used but I really like the color of them and I wanted to try something different. The only thing that these are not a press on nails. This is actually the nails that you need to use glue with. So the glue comes in this set, so you will need to glue them to your nails. I also got myself another set. This is Impress Couture Collection and you can see that these nails are so beautiful. I really like the almond shade. So I already previously purchased similar nails in cream colors, so this time I wanted to go with this beautiful blush pink. And I also really like the length of them and almond shape. I think that out of all Impress nails, that I tried. This is probably my absolute favorite. And I also got myself a kiss glue. So this one is brush on nail glue. So it actually has a brush applicator looking like a nail polish. So I think it will be so easy to apply glue to my nails. I have never tried kiss glue before, but I heard so many great stuff about it that I decided to buy it and try it out. So I also decided to share some essentials that I always use in my shower. So this is my favorite shampoo and conditioner that I always get. I'm using either Moroccan oil or Herbal Essences Moroccan My Shine. I think that this is the closest dupe that I found for my favorite Moroccan oil shampoo and conditioner. Of course it's not the same, but this is the closest that I can find. So I really like how my hair looks, how it feels. I'm using both shampoo and conditioner for many years. I really love and enjoy them and this is my favorite from drugstores that I usually buy. So another my favorite is Nivea Indulgent Body wash. I usually get myself a body wash with orange, but this time I decided to try something different. So I got myself diamond and argan oil. I usually just pick them depending on the scent. I really like something fresh, very 
light so I decided to try out this new for me scent. I really like that they have very light smell and they also make a lot of foam. I don't like this kind of like creamy body washes. I really like any face wash or body wash when it has a lot of foam. And my last dress store purchase is Herbertine Permanent Hair Color Gel. So this is what I use to color my hair. I buy usually the shade 1 and black. So I really like this one because first of all it's not like any other regular drugstore hair color. This one I'm getting in that vegan organic department. So this hair color has 8 herbal extracts so it's very gentle to your hair. It also says it covers 100% great coverage and you can see over here at the bottom it says that it goes for up to 2 applications. It usually lasts me for one because I have very long hair. It also natural and helps you shine vibrant long lasting color. There is no ammonia. I'm not even gonna try to read this one. And there is no parabens, alcohol or fragrance. It is good for sensitive skin. And you can see over here that it's made in Italy. And over here you can see eight organic herbal extracts that go in inside of this hair color. I was using L'Oreal hair color for a very long time. I really like it. But then I decided to switch to something more gentle to my hair and I never looked back. First of all, this hair color doesn't have that horrible hair color smell. It also has gel texture, so it's very easy to apply to your hair. It also covers everything. It lasts me as any usual hair color. And I also notice improvement in my hair after the switch. So if you color your hair at home, I highly recommend you to check this one out. This is my absolute favorite. So now let's move to my recent Sephora purchase. So first of all, I got some samples and also used some of my points. So I got Touches Dewy Skin Cream. So here is how the packaging looks like and over here I have 5 milliliters. Can't wait to test out and try out this cream. I really like Tatcha products so that's why I decided to get myself this sample especially because it is great for dry skin and my skin is normal and usually during the winter times is dry because I live in Canada so we already have snow, it's very cold, it's minus 7 and I already start feeling the tightness and dryness in my skin. So next I have another set from Tatcha. I believe I used 300 points for this set. So it comes with a deep cleanse which has 25 milliliters and also 10 milliliters of the water cream. So this is what was in this set. I think this is enough samples that you can test out and try out products. So I cannot wait to test them out and try them out. I actually already use a water cream. It is more for oily and combination skin but I still like it and I really wanted to try the deep cleanse so that's why I got myself this set. So another sample that I got are from Verb. So it is ghost shampoo and ghost conditioner and also ghost oil. I already remember I was trying this ghost conditioner and shampoo before in one of these four samples. I really like it. And when I saw that there is a big sample, I believe there is like 10 of these packs, I was so excited to have more and test it out and try out more and give this shampoo a go. So another sample that I had with this purchase was a perfume sample from Chloe No Maid. So so this smell nice but as for me they are more like on a warm sweet scent and I prefer more like light and fresh scents. So next sample that I have over here is from Drunk Elephant Elf Balm Electrolyte Water Facial. I wanted to try this out for so long. I heard so many exciting and amazing things about Drunk Elephant. I tested out and tried out their hairline but now I really wanted to test out and try out more of their skincare products. And the last sample from this purchase is Anastasia Beverly Hills Deep Brow Gel and I got it in the shade medium brown. I was very happy that I can use 100 point and exchange it for this sample because I feel it's a great way to test out and try out product and see if you like it or not. So now let's move to what I actually got at Sephora and I purchased myself two holiday collections from Too Faced. So this is Enchanted Beauty Foxy Neutrals limited edition makeup collection. And you can see on the back that it comes with a shadow palette. It also has a travel size damn girl mascara as well as face palette with highlighter and blush. I already have a video on my channel with reviews, swatches and comparison of both sets. So if you if you want to see it I'll put a link in my description down below but now let's take everything out from this packaging and I will show you up close. So we have a travel size of Damn Girl Mascara. We also have eyeshadow palette and I just adore this packaging. And this is how the palette looks inside. It's very beautiful and I like that it has all the matte shapes, one glitter and we have two shimmers over here. And last that we have in this set is face palette with highlighter and also blush. And this is how it looks up close. 
we have a blush and also highlighter over here. And here is the second set, it also from Too Faced, Enchanted Beauty and this time it is unbearably glam. It is also limited edition makeup collection. So over here on the back it also has a shadow palette, this time the travel size mascara is better than sex and also we have highlighter and blush. So here is the travel size of mascara that comes in this set, it is better than sex mascara. Next face palette with highlighter and also blush. And this is how it looks inside, we have highlighter and blush. And last product that we have in this set is a shadow palette. So this is how the palette looks inside. Most of the shades are shimmery or glittery eyeshadows and we have only three matte shades. So this palette is meant for those who really like glittery shimmery eyeshadows and those glam makeup looks. Thank you so much for watching, I really hope that you enjoy. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also give this video a thumbs up if you like it. And I will see you in my next video which which will be my biggest PR haul ever. So stay tuned for that and I'm wishing you an amazing day. Bye bye!